name is Alicia and this is my dog Amy. It's no secret that 2020 was a very long and difficult year for all of us. Today, Amy and I would like to tell the story of how we were able to get through it. It all started in March when we were put under stay at home orders. This was something that was very strange uh, and concerning to us as we had never experienced it before. Then the CDC re released direction about social distancing. We needed to stay six feet apart. We could no longer shake hands. Sit. 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 But we could wave. Amy and I also invented our own version of the COVID friendly high five. Good job. We were also asked to wear masks anytime that we were out in public so that we did not unknowingly spread the virus to anyone. Amy loved helping pick out fun colors and patterns. Catch. Good job. Fine. The restrictions were so tough that for a while, Amy couldn't even go to the groomer. Luckily, Amy is great at taking care of her own nails. We were in quarantine for so long that time seemed to go backwards. Rewind. Hi. Luckily, we still had our spring dog shows to look forward to. Those were all outside, right? They're not going to be canceled. Then one by one, they started to get canceled and we went a little stir crazy. <laughs> Good job, Amy. Still, Amy and I pride ourselves on our positivity. We kept ourselves busy with fun games like Chug. Amy. Chug. Drop. We also kept in shape with fun exercises. Jump. And we focused on music to keep our spirits up. for us was that we received a lot of virtual titling opportunities that we would not have received otherwise. So Amy and I spent the year learning fun new tricks like sit up pretty. She also learned to hoop jump over my back. the mail to see what fun awards we had. Amy and I loved watching the mail to see what certificates or awards we were receiving that week. Amy, check the mail. Oh, you won! 2020 was a long and difficult year. Most of all, I am proud of us and thankful for our home, our health, our positivity, and ability to adapt to such strange, such a strange situation. It will definitely take some jumping through hoops. Jump. Jump. But I do think that we will be able to get back to some sense of normalcy. Most of all, I am proud of Amy. When I adopted Amy, she was a very unruly dog with not a lot of outlets for that energy. Trick training has definitely helped us with this, along with sports. Amy is just the light of my life, and I am so insanely proud of her. Good job, Amy. Thank you so much for watching.